Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Here's just a catch up on my greenhouse. It's uh, sometime in uh, February. I forget the exact date. Uh, this is my uh, begonia. My cactus mixed, my dahlias. These only put in on, but yeah, as you can see, looking really well. Uh, I have my beautiful, absolutely stunning pelagoniums that have flowered all winter because my greenhouse is heated. These are me, my Allianz, Allison's, so they're all growing well. I have my Lupins there, got a bit of snail and slug damage, so they need treating. Sweet peas at the back, these are my, let me think now, let's get the name of those. Anyway, the South African plant, and they flower really well. But yeah, these are my poppies that I've sown, it's just sort of germinating, as you can see. Some more than others, unfortunately I let them dry out, so some of these might not come out. But yeah, you can see there, all starting to grow well. And this, these are my pensimons. Well, I've got Cosmos, Snapdragons, Salvia. And what I've got there, Phlox, Sweet William, Snapdragons, Petunias, Lobelia there. And then I've got Petunia, Lupins, uh, Catmint, Coryopsis, and Phlox. Some of these won't come because some of them are really old seeds, but as you can see there, my uh, penstemons are really looking well. I had to spray them a few times. As you can see, those at the back were left to dry out. And inside here, we have my cuttings, my penstemon cuttings. There, they've all taken really well. They need spraying for powdery mildew as well, pretty regular. My begonias at the back there. But yeah, everything's going really well, as you can see there. At the back there. So yeah, everything's right on schedule so far. I will start sowing some vegetables next week for the allotment. A lot of these are going to go on the allotment, so... Now I've cleared all this area up here, I can get some more plants on here. And when it warms up a little bit, get some uh, transferred over to the green the greenhouse on my allotment, which is unheated, so I need to... Maybe a few more weeks before I put anything in there. But everything in here should look really well this year. I'm going to have some really nice pots and hanging baskets. And some really beautiful Rosa uh, Dahlias. I cannot wait to get these. Give them a few more feeds to get them bulked up a little bit. Then I'll put them up into these 9 centimetre pots. But these uh, lupins were started in a kitchen roll. In a Ziploc bag. And they look really well. Up to now, there's one I potted up into a bigger pot. But you can always tell, look, there's some insect damage on these. See there. Just see there. Yep, so it's been nibbling at them. So I should give those a spray. And I can't wait to get some cuttings taken off this one. I also get the name of this one. I've lost the name tag, but I'll find it. But yeah, I'm going to get some cuttings off this. I'm really bulk this one up this year, get into a bigger pot. My sweet peas are there at the back. Some more cuttings that I forget the name of at the moment, but yeah, that's just a quick catch up on what's going off in my greenhouse. I hope everybody's keeping well with the pandemic. I hope everybody's keeping safe. So yeah, if you've got any questions regarding anything I'm growing at the moment, please don't hesitate to ask. I'll message you back straight away with an answer if I can. And thank you for watching everybody. Please keep safe. Happy sowing, happy growing. Thank you very much. Bye.